DeMar DeRozan spent a couple years down in Texas with the San Antonio Spurs. Now he represents that Chicago Red Bulls taking on the Spurs. Early on in this one, it's Keldon Johnson. He is off to a fantastic start this season. He knocks down a three. Uh, a show of straight class here by Greg Popovich and the San Antonio Spurs. With this jump shot, DeRozan becomes the 50th player to go over 20,000 career points. Coach Pop actually calls a timeout so DeRozan could be honored appropriately. That's just phenomenal to see from Coach Popovich. Chicago, they had a basketball game to win, though. Kobe White knocking down the jump shot. And just like that, it's Chicago up by nine. Of the end we go. Beautiful ball movement ends up in the hands of the rookie. Jeremy Soho knocks down the three. Love his hair, by the way. In the fourth quarter we go. This one getting really good. DeRozan, mid-range jump shot is money. His career resurgence continues. 33 points, 11 of 20 from the field for DeRozan. Alex Caruso getting it inside to the big fella. Andre Drummond had himself a double-double. Chicago's up by seven, looking to put things away on the road. But Keldon Johnson and San Antonio had other plans. An 8-0 run here puts the Spurs in the lead. Johnson with another three. 33 points, a team high for Johnson. Greg Popovich keep one, don't he? He keeps a great player, but then he can't keep the great player. Jakob Pertle goes and one there. How about 21 points, 13 rebounds for Pertle? Pop shows a lot of class, but also gets the dub for his team. Spurs come back to win this one at 129-124. Before this game, the San Antonio Spurs as an organization actually made a shocker of announcement their 12th pick in the 2021 NBA draft, Josh Primo, was let go of the team just seemingly all of a sudden. Uh, the Spurs organization said it is our hope that in the long run, the decision will serve as the best interest of both the organizations and Joshua. Young Primo did release a statement to Wolves of ESPN acknowledging the release. He said, I know that you are all surprised by today's announcement. I've been seeking help to deal with previous trauma I suffered and will now take this time to focus on my mental health treatment more fully. I hope to be able to discuss these issues in the future so I can help others who have suffered in a similar way. I appreciate the privacy at this time. So when you hear an announcement like that, when you hear uh, Josh say, yo, I want to talk about this stuff more in detail um, down the line, when I hear mental health conversations, I'm thinking, oh, man, oh, this sounds serious. Then... Later on, we find out that apparently this story about a young man that's averaging about 5.4 uh, points per game in his career got off to a pretty decent start this year, averaging around seven points a game, five assists a game, somewhere right around it. We're finding out that apparently Josh Primo has exposed himself to multiple women within that San Antonio Spurs organization. Look, best of luck to Josh on his journey. I'm sure he'll get another opportunity elsewhere if he's able to legally deal with what he's got going on and mentally deal with what he's got going on. I do not like, though, the term mental health issues and, and discussion about, like, yo, hey, I want to be able to talk about what's going on with me down the line. I do not like that being the center of this statement before reporters did their job and found out exactly what the heck was going on. Leaving that in the air as if uh, this is nothing more than you being a, a nasty young man is, is to me, disgusting. There are a lot of people around this country that deal with real mental health issues on the daily. Um, I'm sorry. In my world, exposing yourself to women just doesn't, doesn't fit the bill for me and without knowing so many details. Um, prayers to the women and people that maybe were on the other end of being shown private areas that they did not want um, shown to them. How about that? All right. Josh Primo released by the San Antonio Spurs as details start to emerge about exactly why the team decided to make the sudden decision.